Welcome back to our channel. Today, we will explore together the famous movie New Jack City, released in 1991. New Jack City is one of the most prominent urban crime films of the 90s, known for its story attractive and impressive acting. So today we're going to reminisce and watch the show again, with a quick look at the cast from the early days to the present. We will tell you about the original names and ages of the actors in the series and their changes in 2024. Now let's find out together. Number 17. Wesley Snipes, born July 31, 1962, made his big mark in the movie New Jack City when he was 28 years old. In the film, Snipes plays Nino Brown, a ruthless and intelligent drug lord. His role brought a strong and scary charisma, contributing to making New Jack City the classic film about urban crime. Snipes portrays Nino Brown with the perfect combination of strength and charm, turning the character into one of the most memorable villains in film history. The film not only helped Snipes become famous, but also demonstrated his diverse acting abilities. Currently, Wesley Snipes is 61 years old and continues his acting career with many notable roles in both action films and drama films. One of his other prominent roles is Blade in the film series of the same name, affirming Snipes' status as a top Hollywood action star. Number 16. Ice-T, born February 16, 1958, is a famous American hip-hop artist and actor. In the movie New Jack City, when he was 33 years old, he played Scotty Appleton, an undercover police investigator. Ice-T's character is determined to bring down the drug empire of Nino Brown, played by Wesley Snipes. Ice-T's role was highly appreciated for the determination and honesty he brought, creating a strong counterpoint to the villain. New Jack City is an outstanding crime film of the 90s, reflecting the explosion of drugs and violence. After this movie, Ice-T continued to succeed as Detective Odafin Tutwola in Law & Order, Special Victims Unit. Currently, at the age of 66, Ice-T is still active in the entertainment industry, both in music and acting. Number 15. Mario Van Peebles played Detective Stone in the movie New Jack City when he was 34 years old. Not only taking on the role of actor, Van Peebles is also the director of the film, greatly contributing to making New Jack City a classic of the urban crime film genre. Detective Stone is the leader of the police team attempting to take down Nino Brown's drug empire, played by Wesley Snipes. Stone's determination and strength, along with the complexity of fighting crime, are expressed realistically and emotionally by Van Peebles. Mario Van Peebles' acting and directing in New Jack City not only received praise from critics, but also helped him establish his name in the film industry. Currently, at the age of 67, Van Peebles continues his acting and directing career, participating in many film and television projects making significant contributions to the cinema industry. Number 14. Michael Michelle played the character Selena when she was 25 years old. In the movie, Selena is the lover of Nino Brown, a notorious drug lord played by Wesley Snipes. Selena is a strong and seductive woman, helping to highlight the luxury and danger of the criminal world that Nino dominates. Michael Michelle brings edginess and depth to the character of Selena, adding to the complexity of her relationship with Nino. Her acting helped create emotional and tense scenes, contributing to the success of New Jack City. After New Jack City, Michael Michelle continued to develop his acting career with many memorable roles on both the big and small screen. 
She is known for her roles in television series such as ER and Homicide, Life on the Street. Currently, at the age of 57, Michael Michelle continues to participate in many film and television projects, affirming her position as one of Hollywood's talented actresses. Number 13, Alan Payne, born July 7, 1968, played G-Money in the movie New Jack City when he was 23 years old. The character G-Money is the right-hand man and best friend of Nino Brown, the notorious drug lord played by Wesley Snipes. Payne's role brings depth to the story, as G-Money undergoes a transformation from a loyal friend to a traitor due to the lure of power and money. Alan Payne brilliantly portrays the complexity and inner conflict of G-Money, helping to highlight the darker and realistic aspects of urban criminal life. His performance in New Jack City helped Payne receive recognition and establish his position in the film industry. Currently, Alan Payne is 55 years old and still continues his acting career. He is best known for his role as C.J. Payne in the television series Tyler Perry's House of Pain, where he continued to demonstrate his talent and versatility in acting. Number 12 Russell Wong, born on March 1, 1963, played the character Troy when he was 28 years old. In the film, Troy is an undercover agent who plays a key role in infiltrating and destroying the criminal empire led by Nino Brown. Russell Wong gives the character Troy a sharpness and determination, contributing to increasing the appeal and drama of the film. With his strong acting, Wong portrayed the image of a brave agent who is not afraid of danger to complete his mission. After New Jack City, Russell Wong continued to build a rich acting career with many prominent roles in films such as Romeo Must Die and The Joy Luck Club, among many other television series. Currently, he is living happily at the age of 61. Number 11. Bill Nunn played Robbie Robertson in the movie New Jack City when he was 37 years old. In the film, Nunn's character, Da 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 Man, is a member of the Cash Money Brothers gang led by Nino Brown. Da 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 Man is a tough and loyal character, helping to highlight the danger and violence of the criminal world the gang controls. Bill Nunn gave the character Da 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 Man majesty and strength, increasing the tension and danger in the scenes. His acting helped create memorable and dramatic moments that contributed to the success of New Jack City. After New Jack City, Bill Nunn continued his acting career with many impressive roles in films such as Do the Right Thing and Sam Raimi's Spider-Man series. He is known and loved for his diverse and vibrant roles. Bill Nunn passed away on September 24, 2016, at the age of 62, leaving a memorable legacy in the hearts of fans and the film industry. Number 10. Vanessa Williams, born March 18, 1963, starred in the movie New Jack City when she was 28 years old. In the film, she plays Keisha, a woman who holds an important role in a criminal organization led by Nino Brown. Vanessa Williams' performance as Keisha brings impressive charm and strength. She portrays a complex, powerful, and at the same time risky character who forms an integral part of the story. After New Jack City, Vanessa Williams' career continued to develop with many roles in both music and film. She has achieved great success with various projects, including her music career and acting on screen and stage. She is now 61 years old and continues to work as an artist.
Number 9. Fab Five Freddy, real name Fred Brathwaite, born August 31, 1959, is one of the iconic figures in the hip-hop world. In the movie New Jack City, Fab Five Freddy plays the master of ceremonies, who is responsible for leading events, especially hip-hop performances. This role not only demonstrates Fab Five Freddy's professionalism and understanding of street culture, but also brings authenticity and flexibility to the film's setting. When participating in the movie New Jack City, Fab Five Freddy was 32 years old. Currently 65 years old, he continues to be a prominent figure in the hip-hop community and contemporary culture. In addition to his acting career, Fab Five Freddy is also active in the artistic field, being a multi-talented artist, photographer, and independent filmmaker, contributing to the development and spread of hip-hop culture all around the world. Number 8. Anthony DeSando, born December 4, 1965, played Frankie Needles in the movie New Jack City when he was 25 years old. In the film, Frankie Needles is a gangster involved in the underworld of drugs and crime, working for a criminal organization run by Nino Brown. Anthony DeSando's performance added to the complexity and tension of the film, providing an astute perspective on the trials and dangers of the criminal world. He excellently portrayed the character Frankie Needles, contributing to the success of New Jack City. Currently, Anthony DeSando is 58 years old and continues to pursue an acting career with many roles in both movies and television. He has proven his talent through many diverse roles, leaving a deep impression in the hearts of the audience. Number 7. John Apria, born March 4, 1941, played Frankie Needles in the movie New Jack City when he was 50 years old. In the film, Frankie Needles is a gangster involved in the underworld of drugs and crime, working for a criminal organization run by Nino Brown. John Apria's performance added to the complexity and tension of the film, providing an astute perspective on the trials and dangers of the criminal world. He excellently portrayed the character Frankie Needles, contributing to the success of New Jack City. Currently, John Apria is 83 years old and continues to pursue an acting career with many roles in both movies and television. He has proven his talent through many diverse roles, leaving a deep impression in the hearts of the audience. Do you like this character in the movie? If so, leave comment number one. If you don't like, leave comment number zero. Number 6. Jed Nelson, born November 28, 1959, played Nick Peretti in the movie New Jack City when he was 31 years old. Nick Peretti is a tough cop, determined to take down the criminal organization led by Nino Brown. This role shows the contrast between the criminal world and those who are trying to fight it, while also demonstrating the complexity and contradictions of police work. Jed Nelson brought strength and determination to the character Nick Peretti, helping to highlight the tensions and conflicts in the film. This role not only helped him become more known to movie audiences, but also strengthened his acting career. Currently, Jed Nelson is 64 years old and continues to be active in the entertainment industry, appearing in many different films and television shows. Number 5. Nick Ashford, born May 4, 1941, is best known as a famous musician, singer, and music producer. However, in the movie New Jack City, he played a special part as Reverend Oates, an influential pastor in the community. When participating in the film, Nick Ashford was 50 years old. Reverend Oates is a remarkable character, bringing morality and belief in good values amid the film's violence and crime. 
Ashford's performance added depth to the story and highlighted the struggle between good and evil within the community. Nick Ashford, along with his wife, Valerie Simpson, is part of the musical duo Ashford and Simpson, known for many classic hits such as Ain't No Mountain High Enough and Solid. His musical career left an indelible mark on the music industry. Nick Ashford passed away on August 22, 2011, at the age of 70, but his musical legacy and artistic contributions are still remembered and cherished. Number 4. Christopher Williams, born August 22, 1967, starred in the movie New Jack City when he was 24 years old. In the film, Williams plays Kareem Akbar, a member of a criminal group controlled by Nino Brown. Christopher Williams' performance as Kareem Akbar attracted attention with his versatility and sharpness. With this role, he demonstrated his multidimensional acting ability and contributed to highlighting the picture of crime in the film. After New Jack City, Christopher Williams continued his career in the music and film industries. He has continued to participate in musical projects and also had several roles in other films and television shows. He is currently 56 years old and continues to work in the entertainment industry. Number 3. Bill Cobbs, born June 16, 1934, is an American actor with a diverse career on stage, small and big screen. In the movie New Jack City, Cobbs played Old Man Quillis, an elderly, bright and respectable character. With a realistic and thoughtful performance, he brings a layer of culture and understanding to his role. When he starred in the movie New Jack City, Bill Cobbs was 57 years old. Currently, he is 90 years old, still continuing his acting career and contributing to diverse artistic projects. With many years of experience and exceptional talent, Bill Cobbs is one of the most admired actors in the film industry. Number 2. Chris Rock, one of the famous comedians and favorite actors, played the role of Pookie in the movie New Jack City. In the film, he demonstrates his multidimensional acting ability through the character Pookie, a drug addict trying to escape the criminal world. With a sharp and emotional performance, Chris Rock brought a touch of reality and humanity to this role. When participating in New Jack City, Chris Rock was 26 years old. Currently, he is 58 years old and continues to be one of the prominent faces of the entertainment industry. Number 1. Tracy Camilla Johns, born April 12, 1963, is an American actress famous for her roles in films directed by Spike Lee. In the movie New Jack City, she plays Uniqua, the girlfriend of main character Nino Brown, played by Wesley Snipes. When participating in the film, Tracy Camilla Johns was 28 years old. Uniqua is a charismatic, captivating character and an important part of Nino Brown's complicated and dangerous life. Tracy Camilla John's performance added depth and nuance to the film, creating a clear picture of life and relationships in the criminal underworld of New York City. Tracy Camilla John's is best known for her role as Nola Darling in Spike Lee's She's Gotta Have It, 1986, a film that marked her career breakthrough and helped her gain recognition as an actress talent. Although she does not often appear on screen, each of her roles leaves a strong and deep impression on the audience. Currently, Tracy Camilla Johns is living happily at the age of 61. Thank you for joining us on this exploration of the cast's transformation in New Jack City. If you have enjoyed the journey through time with us, please support us by liking this video, sharing it with your friends, and subscribing to our channel so you don't miss out on interesting content. Please, see you in the next video.